Welcome back to the final episode of the Walking Dead Telltale series, episode 5, A New Frontier, from the Gallows of Doom. Anyway, let's play. If you do enjoy, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and let's do this. Previously on The Walking Dead. Whatever this thing is between us, I want to give it a chance. And I know the fact that David is back in our lives now makes this whole thing a little more complicated. But do you feel the same way? I'm in. All the way. Oh my god, really? Really. Just look what he's done. I had a very interesting conversation with your friend, Eleanor, last night. Isn't that right, Eleanor? We did. You've put me in a no-win situation here. Both of them deserve to die for their crimes. However, Javi, I'll let you spare one of them. Just one. Trip has to live. Shoot him. Wait! I said Trip should live! No! How about you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? We're leaving. All of us. Right now. <laughs> it's Kate. She's coming for us. Oh, God. Kate! And that's where the previous episode ended. Now... For this episode, what will happen? This game series is adapted to the choice you make. The story is tailored by how you play. It can't be. <laughs> While we're still breathing, Javi, I'm letting the bones speak to me. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I think I can hear them. They're saying, You're gonna lose, come mierda, so play already. I must have inherited patience from Ma. Oh, come on, man. Calm down, David. One or two. Never in a rush to lose. Let's play one. Victoria. Carajo. I was so close. You're now my least favorite son, Javier. Hey, he's the one who beat you. Fine. It's a tie. I hate you both equally. Kicked out of baseball. Can't play dominoes. What exactly are you good at again, Javi? At least I can actually play baseball. Slugger. That's enough, both of you. It's not Javi's fault he's a disgrace to the game of dominoes. I won. That's ten bucks you owe me. Both of you. I know you're broke, Javi. You should sit out the next game since we all know I'm gonna win. No shame in surrender. We'd all understand. Now, don't break your hand patting yourself on the back. I'll beat you next time. Should you even be betting on these games? Isn't that what got you in trouble to begin with? Do we need to have an intervention? Now, keep on talking, David. See what happens. Hey, hey, this is Domino's. Winning means you get to be a little bit of a pendejo. <laughs> Pay up, little brother. If you can. I'll cover for Javier. Oh, is it your turn to do that now? I lost track. Poor, helpless Javi. Get my wallet, mijo. Keep an eye on him. You don't want him snatching an extra 20 for gas money. It's on the counter. Yeah, sure, Pa. Pa? What's this? Hey, man, I was reading that. What? Wait, what's up? What the fuck is this? None of your business. He has cancer. What? 
Oh, really? I'm old. Old people get cancer. You didn't need to know. That's not for you to decide. You really should have told us. It's the right thing to do. It's my cancer. I get to do whatever I want. You know now. What difference does it make? How bad? It's okay, mijo. Ask me. How bad is it? You won't have to worry about paying me back that ten bucks. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, Pa. Hey, settle, David. Now. You haven't told Mama. And neither will either of you. You hear me? Mouth shut. That's not okay, Pa. You have to tell her. Uh, when the time is right, I, I will. That's not good enough. It's good enough for me. You're gonna need her help with this, Pa. Driving you to the doctor, getting prescriptions. Wait, what are your options? Treatment, stuff like that. Chemo, radiation, all that expensive mierda. Great. When do you start? I turned it down. Turned it down? You don't get to turn it down. So much money and for what? Another month. Another game of dominoes to lose. It's not worth it. If I was still playing ball, I could have paid for it. I'll pay for it. It's not happening. Save your money. Fuck the money. I can afford it. You can afford it, David. But my pride can't. Let's play another game. You are a fucking coward. A selfish coward. Javi, can you believe this shit? What the fuck, David? Apologize now. Sit down. Both of you. You know, I pray for daughters. <laughs> Every night your mother was pregnant with both of you. Please, God, a daughter. Anything but a son. Anything but another me. Anything but another hot-headed idiot with his heart in the right place. Anything but another foolhardy, handsome gambler. Anything at all. Please, Papa. Don't give up. Fight. Fight for our name. For our blood. For our family. Please, fight. You have to fight, Pa. We don't just give up, any of us. Okay. Okay? Okay. I'll think about it. Oh, thank you, Pa. Thank you, Javi. Now can we play another game? I'll grab some more beers. So, what are you really gonna do? Truth be told, Whatever gets your mother off my ass. You think you two were mad at me for keeping secrets? Hm. But it's good to see you and David on the same side of things, or a change. I'm gonna be a name carved in stone before you know it, Javier. That'll be me. Letters on a rock that nobody wants to visit. I know you think you're strong enough to handle that alone. And so does your brother. And you're both wrong. You have to take care of each other. You two are all I'll leave behind, like Gabe and Mariana will be for David. Legacy, Javier. It's all anyone leaves behind. That and their bones. Be brothers before it's too late. That's not too much to ask. One last favor for your old man. Okay, Pa, I'll try. As hard as you can. As... as hard as I can. I still need to pay, David. Pa. Oi, if you had just won the game, we wouldn't have had this problem. <laughs> so you're blaming me for all this? I'm depending on you, mijo. We both are. Now I'm gonna steal his wife. If she's alive. Kate!
goodness. have gotten out. If something's happened to her, if you've gotten her... You better hope she's alive. Shut up for once and help me find her. What do you think I'm doing? Kate! 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 David, wait! So glad Harvey, you're... thank God you're all right. I'm just glad you're still in one piece. Thanks for making it back to me. We'll just play along. You're alive. I thought I lost you back there. Same. What's the matter with you two? Focus on your surroundings. There's Gabe and Clem. Lead the way, Javi. Get the knee, like this. Nice. I got a great teacher. You guys all right? Yeah. I'm fine. Look at them! There's so many! We'll be safer inside! Get in! We got a lot of knees to, knees to kick there, you know? <laughs> we all can learn a thing or two from Clementine. That should hold them for now. You put up a good fight out there. I don't care what you think. Gabriel, do not take that tone with me. You murdered that man after they let you go. You're a killer, just like they said. You did that? You don't understand. It was them or us. I had to do it. They would never let us go. They still would have killed us, sooner or later. It wasn't pretty, but you're right. Joan was gonna kill you to cover up her own crimes. We couldn't trust her to keep a promise. Exactly. His brains splattered all over me. You are my son. I am doing what any parent would do to keep you safe. You do not get to judge my actions. Do you hear me? Hey, you do not walk away from me. When someone speaks to you, you stand up and answer them. Even if you don't want to. He's scared. Cut him some slack. He's scared because you've coddled him. He has to learn to deal with his problems. I'm just... I'm trying to protect you, Gabe. I lost you once. I won't let it happen again. Okay? We made it through alive. Let's just be glad about that. We need to check the other entrances. Make sure we're safe. Gabe, wanna help me out? Javi? Gabriel! Go help him, Gabe. It's okay. He doesn't need your permission. I'll help too. O okay. Hey, Clem is with them. It's fine. It's not that. It's. Let's just. <sighs> I'm all over the place. I need to focus on something, anything. Just need to focus on whatever. 
Let's just go upstairs. The further we are from these doors, the happier I'll be. I just want to get as much distance between us and the Muertos as I can. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Let's go. Oh my god. This is a fucking nightmare. Mommy, it's them. I'm glad Mariana didn't live to see this. To see what her father's become. To see what I've done. She'd be just like that little boy. Scared that the monsters are coming after her next. She would never trust us again. And I wouldn't blame her. Kate, come on. We're not monsters. I don't know who we are anymore. But it's not the people she knew. I did this to them. That hole is there because of me. This is all my fault. I'm just as responsible for it as you are. You weren't behind the wheel, Javi. It's different. I can't leave until I make this right. All of this. Let's fix this as best we can. All right, Kate. Let's make things right. I don't know if it's actually possible, but I feel a lot better knowing you're there, too. Episode 5 from the Gallows of Doom. Trip was my best friend, Javi. He died because of you. He didn't deserve this. You have no one to blame but yourself. Your actions betrayed Trip, And to think of how much he cared about you. I never thought it would be like this. You have to believe that. Everyone from Prescott is dead. Everyone but... me. What's done is done. I don't have to like it. But I can't change it. But you... You've got a lot of nerve showing up here. After the bullshit you pulled! You're unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable! We're here to help. Let's settle this and focus on that. You want to help? <sighs> yeah, that's laughable. Why did you tell Joan what we were doing? I was triaging a bad situation. Their doctor is barely functioning. And before you guys fucked it all up, their walls worked. It's not only about me. I can actually save lives here. Not just stitch them up and hope for the best. These people will die without me, Javi. I know she, well, fucked us over, but she's trying to help them. She's trying to make something right. That's worth forgiving, right? She's trying, that counts. She's doing a good thing now, but she's got a long way to go before I forgive her. <laughs> You're one to talk. We should try to help. Not everyone here is guilty. Did you see a little girl out there? She was right behind me. I'm sorry. I haven't seen any little girls. First Rufus. Oh, my baby girl. She knew Rufus. He was her husband until you shot him in the back. She's one of my people, Eleanor. What's going on with her? She'll be all right. She's not bitten or anything. She lost her daughter out there. I know. I'm so sorry. Christ, there's nothing worse than losing a child. Tell me about it. Give her some privacy. It's the least we can do. I want to help you. Okay, well, 
What the? We're all fucking dead because of you! Hey, easy. You We're... blew a hole in our wall! Got my little girl killed! Richmond was fine until your stupid easy ass for... showed up. We're dead fucking meat, David. Might as well take out this asshole while I can. Fern. Shut up! You're wrong. This wasn't my fault. But it was my baby! Stand down. That's an order. Kate, no! Fern, this is all because of me. I caused the explosion. I killed your daughter. Please, forgive me. It's my fault. Please. Please, forgive both of us. <sighs> no! Fern! Holy oh, shit! Kate! Oh my god! Oh my god! Dad! You're welcome, Javi. That dead guy! David, what are you doing? This isn't right! David! Oh my god, this is unacceptable! Did you really need to break her arm? That wasn't necessary! Okay, don't thank me. No! David! Gabe! I I I'm sorry, that was an accident. You were going to kill her! She was going for her gun! Look at her! Gabe, I'm... She can't even stand up! What the hell is wrong with you? It was over the line, Gabe. You're right. Gabe... I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that to you. You know that. Why the hell are you all looking at me that way? They're just... They're scared, David. Of what? I'm protecting them! Then why are you pointing a gun at us? So I'm all alone. Fine, then. You people are on your own. Such an asshole. I've seen that look in his eyes before. You should go after him. I don't want to. I, I, dude. Disarming a girl doesn't require to break her arm. Like, the finger wasn't even on the trigger, dude. We were fine. David? What are you doing? Come on. Just take a step back. You wouldn't want to, you know, slip or something. Come over here. Or are you afraid of me too? I know the rest of them are, right? I'm a lot more afraid of falling. And I'm even more afraid of landing. There's nothing to be afraid of. It'd be over in an instant. My wife, Javi, my son, they look at me differently. Maybe you're seeing them differently. I want to show you something. Stand with me. Why the hell are you smiling? See that sewer line over there? Perfect placement for a trench. That hill about a hundred paces west of it. Sniper's wildest dream come true. I'm a soldier, Javi. I see this landscape like a painter sees a blank canvas. Like how you used to see a baseball diamond. I'm a soldier. This makes sense to me. I was made for this. I thrive in this. Maybe it's crazy. But sometimes crazy things make sense. If only a little. I'm surprised you understand. A soldier isn't a husband. Or a father. 
A soldier is a soldier. Nothing else. Nothing. Nothing at all. Call yourself whatever you want. I still see you as my brother. That is kind of you to say, Javi. I wish... I wish I had your heart sometimes. I want to change, Javi. I always have. Really? All you ever tried to do was get me to change. <sighs> Only because I couldn't bring myself to do it first. It's the one war I could never win. And I'm wondering why. Is it because I don't know how? Or because it's impossible to change who you really are? There's a way. There always is. No matter how lost you are. You just have to keep looking until you find it. Looks pretty messy. For now. Maybe you're right. Maybe. Just gotta live long enough to find out. Just like with anything else. I did what you asked. You did. Thanks for that. So now, will you step back? <sighs> sure. I found them! They're up here! Be careful, Javi. I ran into... <sighs> she was still outside when we checked on the entrances. There were muertos everywhere. We got her inside just in time. Seriously, I've never seen so many muertos. Oh, it's awful out there. <sighs> well, this won't be awkward whatsoever. Ava, uh, about earlier. I guess I owe you an explanation about what happened on the stage with Joan and Tripp. You don't have to say anything to me. Your actions said plenty. I read you loud and clear, but... Go ahead and say whatever you want. I stand by my decision. I'd do it again. Just be glad the situation was what it was. And that she didn't make me pick between you and your brother. <laughs> True. Because I would lose, obviously. There's so many. They're pouring in. <sighs> you don't know the half of it. The herd has taken over Richmond. The streets are filled with walkers. With that hole in the wall, this city is fucked. We're not safe here. No one is. Oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck have we done? So what do we do? I don't want to die up here. None of us do, Gabe. Stabilize the city. Figure out how to make it safer for everyone. I saw construction vehicles when we got the armored truck. We can use those to stop the muertos, seal the breach, and save Richmond. That's over by the motor pool at the water tower. We could use the highway overpass to get to the water tower. Come on. Let's jump. Are you sure about that? Come on. It's an easy jump. <clears throat> Keep your eyes open, stay aware of your surroundings, all of you. Let's move out. When we found Kate earlier, she hugged you. Why do you think she hugged you? Why was that? Just wondering. That can only mean one thing. She likes me more. Not a great time to joke around, Avi. I'm not joking around. I, I, that's my way of telling you, like... You're single. We need to be careful up here or else the exact same thing will happen to us. Stay sharp, and do not fire your guns. We're gonna be fine. That guy was all alone. We're not. I don't trust that board much, dude. <laughs> Can we please walk one at a time? 
Everyone hold back. Let Hobby and I clear out these walkers. Good to go. Let's move. You okay, bud? I was little, Dad used to ask me what I wanted to be when I was a man. And I pointed him. He always liked that. I thought he was such a great guy. It would always make him smile. Every time. David may not be perfect, but he's not the worst role model in the world. Maybe. Be like your uncle. He told me that all the time. Don't be a man who relies on other people to solve your problems. Because then you're not a man at all. I used to think he was right. Not anymore, though, Javi. I can only hope I grow up to be like you. So, here's hoping. I hate to admit it, but the guy may have had a point. I screwed up pretty badly, buddy. So what? You bounced back. Dad was wrong. You took such good care of me. Now we need to take care of Dad. He's the one that needs our help. You're gonna have to go around the side. There's barely any room. No time to waste. Come on. You know, I didn't think there was much that could scare me anymore. And yet, here we are. Just goes to show you. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my life god. Life is full of surprises. I'm not just scared. Yeah, I'm fucking terrified. Ava died a hero. I was gonna die. She saved my life, David. She would do it again, too. Let's keep going. Ava would kick my ass if she knew I was sitting around crying. It's water down there. I know Gabe doesn't see it, but David really is trying to look out for him. He's not doing the best job, but no one gives you a rule book to raise a kid. And they sure as shit don't. There's just one thing I don't get, though. Did David really think he was helping AJ by letting him go? Why did he stop guarding him? Maybe you should ask him that. It might be that he just didn't care. Not everyone's like you, Clem. Not everyone wants to take care of a baby. I guess not, but after you put in all that work, so much of your heart... AJ was a brat. He lived with me after we kicked you out, Clem. I'd already raised two kids. Thought it'd be a piece of cake. <laughs> not with that tyrant. Is that why you gave him away? We had a bad winter. Destroyed every crop we had. I couldn't leave Richmond. And AJ couldn't stay in Richmond. I gave AJ to Lingard and told him to do whatever he had to to save his life. 
I miss that breath. Never asked Lingard about it again. Though I've wanted to. Often. I'll bet the little brat misses you too. Both of you. It wasn't easy, Clem. Remember, far as I knew, I'd already lost two children. It wasn't any easier with number three. It's never easy. I'm gonna keep you alive. Keep all of us alive. And hope that that's enough. Enough for atonement. We're all abandoned one way or the other eventually. I guess AJ's no different. Holy shit. Chopped right in half. What the hell happened here? Chopper landing. You're not thinking. It's that or go back. We should go lightest to heaviest. That way it won't break on the first swing. I'll go first, Clem. Get a long run up, but not too long. If you take too many quick steps, you'll propel yourself upward instead of out. David, he's got this. She's right. I do. <sighs> Come on, Clem. Your turn. thing not at all it's one thing for the kids to swing across but us you've got this i've seen you do things that are way scarier okay i can do it <sighs> all right david you're up you're the little brother you should go first. Oh, you're definitely lighter. Maybe I am younger, but I'm not little anymore. Okay, big guy. This is a zombie, dude. <laughs> uh. What are you looking at? times you have to say come on you okay good work everyone just like we rehearsed i don't know i think we can do better head back over let's try that again enough come on Almost there.
Well, that was close. I miss when all we did was track the herd. From a safe distance. We need to get down there. We're not getting anywhere without one of those vehicles. It's not like we can just ask all those walkers to move out of the way. How about we make some noise and distract them? We could use that generator. That's a great idea, Gabe. When did you get so smart, Gabe? You really aren't the same kid I remember. I'm impressed, really. Oh. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. We still gotta get to the generator somehow. Cut a walker open and cover yourself with its guts. Then you can slip right through them. What? Ugh. I, please tell me you're kidding. I said please. So, who's gonna do it? Javi, you've been willing to do some crazy stuff for me before. I know shooting Conran wasn't easy, but it showed me I can always depend on you. Of course, Clem. Look, it smells really bad. Like, way worse than you think. <sighs> Isn't it your turn to step up, Clem, since you actually know how to do it in the first place? You'll do. What are you looking at? You did it, Javi. Barely. Now that we're here, we gotta find something to seal the breach with. All we need is the right vehicle. Oh, that's not gonna do the job, man. Yes, it is. What are you doing? The right thing. I'm leaving. We're all leaving. What? And going where? 
You saw it yourself. We're surrounded by the herd. I'm taking my family out of here. You helped keep them safe, Clem. You're coming too. Let's go. Everyone. We can't wait around. This is bullshit, David. Absolutely not. Everyone in Richmond will die without us. They don't matter, Javi. Don't you get that? This all started the day we knocked on Richmond's door. We brought this on these people, all of us. We can't abandon them. Not after what we've done. We're going home, Kate. Back to the last place we were a family. We're starting over. We're all together again, finally. It's time, all of us, a new day, a new life. That's crazy talk, David. Home is gone, just like everything else. I thought you guys were gone once, and I was wrong. Maybe you're wrong too. I'll go with you, Dad. Gabe! He's my father, Clem. I'm sorry, but you really wouldn't understand. Think this over, buddy. Gabe, is this what you really want? I know it's scary out there, but I have to. You don't have to be afraid, Gabe. I won't let what happened to Mariana happen to you. You have my word. I will protect you the right way. That's fucking bullshit, David. She was lucky to have us. At least we were actually around a race. Javi, just stop. This is what I want. I... I understand, Gabe. I'm still going back. I won't be able to live with myself if I don't try to help the people in Richmond. You won't be able to live at all if you do that. Richmond is compromised. It doesn't matter if there were five of us trying to save it or 500. We'd all die. I know a losing battle when I see one. We're moving out. Everybody get in. That's an order. How fucking dare you? What will it take, David? What will it take to show you that you do not get to do that? We are not your soldiers. Run away home. Be a deserter. I am done with you. Let's go, Javi. Why the fuck do you think he would go with you? Tell him. What the fuck is this? Javi! David, I thought you were dead. We were together in that van for years, David. I, I mean, years! You, you shouldn't be so surprised. I should have known. I should have known the night Pa died. The night you weren't there. Blood is worthless to you. Just like he was to you. Just like I am to you. Well, it's time for you to finally learn what blood really means! David! Dad! What do you have to say for yourself, brother? David! Stop it! I love you. No. No, you don't get to say that! <laughs> Jesus Christ, stop! How fucking dare That's you! That's enough! Stop it! David, stop! <laughs> I love you! No! Stop saying that! Dad, no! Gabe! Oh my god! You're not taking my family from me! David, no! I'm gonna fucking kill you! I love you, brother. No! I have a great time.
David took him. We can't wait any longer. We have to go help Richmond. I'm getting on that bulldozer. But Gabe! Gabe wanted to go. He did. We all heard it. You're... you're right. I'm going to save Richmond. Someone has to. I'm with you, Javi. We can go after Gabe on that motorcycle or go help Kate on the bulldozer. Wherever you go, I go. We're out of time. Javi, I'm sorry. I've been here before, more than once. It's not gonna end well for everyone. You have to decide. I can't let Kate go by herself. It's too dangerous. I'm going with Kate to save the city. What about you, Clem? Like I said, I'm with you, Javi. Let's go save Richmond. Then we go after Gabe? Then we go after Gabe, if we don't die first. If we're gonna drive into the herd, we're gonna need these. I'm not, I, I honestly don't want even, I don't really want to save Gabe, to be honest. He wanted to go with, uh, with his father. Well, there's a happy sight. Can you help us get the gate open? Almost didn't recognize you, Jesus. Once I got in contact with my people, I headed right back. Had to make sure you folks were safe. I think I'm getting the hang of this. We'll keep the muertos away. Just get me to the gate so I can open it up. I got your back, Javi! We're almost there! Javi, get in the busket and I'll lift you to the top of the gate! Busket? The thing in the front! The scooper thing! Whatever! Get in it! I'll keep them off you! Are you sure about that? Clementine, do your job, girl. Yuck. Javi, the basket! Right. Yeah, basket. Nice see you folks to drop by. They couldn't just have an open gate button. <sighs> nope. Okay, never pull that lever again, Javier. Uh... Oh, shit. Are you trying to attract even more walkers? No. <laughs> Inside and wrangle the walkers together. If we get them in one group, we can lead them right out. Jesus is such a cool character, honestly.
Fingers crossed. Let's get out of here. I would move the construction vehicle against the car. We need to round up these walkers. Head them towards the gate. Welcome back. I thought we were coming back to, uh, well, not to this. It's just a little surprising. That's all. This? Huh, this is just another Tuesday in Richmond. We need to get it under control. Trouble in one place usually finds its way to another. Javi, we have to go after Gabe. These guys can take care of the rest of the walkers. Go, Javi. I'll help out here. Okay. Let's go, Clem. Who cares about Gabe? He wanted to go with his father. Oh my goodness. Him, Javi. <laughs> That's when we crash. God damn. David! He fought for me, Javi. Until they. <coughs> but I couldn't. There were so many. I fucked up. After everything you taught me. Oh, it really hurts. Really bad. <laughs> Easy, boy. Don't worry about any of that now. I'm here for you. You always have been. No, Gabe. No. Do me a favor, Glenn. Gabe, no. Take my cards. What? My playing cards. Grab them. TJJ Euchre. Okay? <laughs> okay. Be strong, Gabe, for whatever comes next. I will. You'd better. <laughs> Bye, Gabe. Bye, Glenn. G give me your gun, Javi. <clears throat> I don't want it turned to a muerto. Gabe. I... Gabe, I... I don't know if I can let you do that to yourself. And I can't make you guys do it for me. Just give me the gun. Hurry. Hurry. Okay, Gabe. Here you go. You may not be my father, Javi, but you are a great dad. Please, walk away. I just want you to see this. Okay. Bye, Javi. Bye, buddy. I love you. I love you, too. I'll say hi to Mariana, or you.
Oh my goodness. Okay, I didn't expect him to be... Dead? Wow, couldn't get, leave them for two seconds, bro. Glad you helped me, Javi. But I can't stop wondering how things might be different if you hadn't. Maybe Gabe wouldn't be with Mariana right now. They deserved better, Javi. Better than us. Gabe. Mariana. This wasn't our fault. This was David. It was all of us. Usually the quiet scares me. What about now? There's a lot of work to be done. The herd could come back. Still though, I feel more calm here than... than I ever did in an old van on streets with no streetlights. We earned this, Javi. We earned feeling calm in the quiet. Let's start a family. You and me. Jeez, I just want to date you. What do you say? <laughs> I think it'd be good for us. Could put some brakes on that. You're on. Let's start a family. You don't think it's selfish? It's not the safest world outside of Richmond. Or inside it, truth be told. So long as I got you, I'm not too worried about it. We can just adopt Clementine and AJ if he's alive. We'll be up there before we know it. Better do something worthwhile in the meantime. I can barely call her a girlfriend and she wants like, oh, let's start a family. <laughs> Can't get over it. Head now? Yes, indeed. We came here to put an end to the raiding. Looks like that's been done. Glad we got it settled. Gotta move on. I gotta admit, man, you're a fucking badass. You're a real charmer. You know that? Through and through. Are you really sure you don't want to stay? There's room. Oh, <laughs> I'm sure there is. But we got other people depending on us, Javi. Just the way it is. I was worried about you, Javi. About who you are inside. You helped save these people, though. That goes a long way for me. Second chances are in short supply these days. That's what this place can be if you let it. Trust me, though. Life within walls is a hell of a lot different than life on the road. Don't take shortcuts like Joan. You gotta do the right thing. Always. Good days, and especially bad. Absolutely. The right thing. No matter what. Good to hear. I read people pretty well. Little gift of mine. You're a capable guy, Javi. Change is in the air here. You can lead that change, and I think you should. For the better. God knows this town could use it. You know what? I'm gonna step up. Lead this place in the right direction. Then as far as I'm concerned, Richmond's in much better hands than it was. Be vigilant. Trouble never stays too far away.
You're alive. Don't remind me. I'm not gonna say thank you for keeping me alive, but I'm gonna try and find something out there that might make me say thank you. Someday. So where's AJ? Tell me. Where? You know Clem won't rest until she finds AJ. Where is he? Please, man. For her sake. He's at McCarroll Ranch. It's not too far from here. That's... That's where we left him, at least. Thank you. Good luck out there, Doctor. So you're out of here too, huh? Yeah. It's time. I have to find AJ, Javi. I've waited so long. But could you do me one last favor before I leave? She wants a nipple twist. I can sense it. I used to do this for my niece. That's nice of you. She thought I was terrible at it. Were you? Not your business. I have to see AJ Javi. I have to see that he's okay. Do you think he remembers me? At least a little? Maybe? Who could forget you, Clem? No one who knew you, I guarantee it. Yeah, maybe. Everyone told us he was better off. After everything that's happened, I'm starting to think they're right. I don't know if I was a good mom or not. I can't stop thinking about it. I really wish I could. Did you love him? With all of my heart. And of course you were. Gabe told me you used to play baseball. I did. I loved it. He told me you fucked it all up too. Yep. Sure did. Well, you survived. I had to. But you loved it. How do you survive that? How? If you really loved it, how? I'd really like to tell you that it fades away and you just you get over it. But when you really love it, you never do. Not really. Yeah, that sounds about right. All done. Well, how's it look? Looks kind of weird. <laughs> you know what? I'll grab your hat. Let's just break every mirror here and you'll be fine. Your dad ever teach you about baseball? No, not really. Well, you come back, and I'll tell you all about it. It's a deal. If I bring AJ back with me, will you teach him too? You bet. He belongs with you, Clementine. Bring him back. Clementine looks actually nice with this haircut. I 
I just didn't expect Gabe to die, actually. From the gallows, there we go, we're done with the game. That sounds like copyright, my buddy. Get me out of here quickly before he starts singing. Now... They literally forced that copyright song down your throat. Oh my goodness. Well, hopefully we can play it. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, we're not monetized yet, but yeah. At the end of the day, I don't like it when, you know, copyright is forced down your throat because all these songwriters, they can actually hold your YouTube channel accountable for whatever. Maybe they just dislike your channel and just give you a strike. So I dislike any copyright just because of that factor. But yeah, we finished uh, a new frontier here, uh, Telltale Games. So there's one more season to continue on with. Uh, obviously, there's more The Walking Dead games. I think I know about 400 Days and Michonne. And unfortunately, if I go here to Definitive Series, I think you can't play either of those. There's no 400 Days there, which was like a DLC on Season 2. Uh, you play as Bonnie, and I don't think it's in actually this game. And then Michonne. I think Michonne is in this game. Yeah. So we have the final season and Michonne. Uh, I don't know if I should play Michonne first, because I would like to end it with Clementine, if that makes sense. Um, you can see AJ standing there in the front as well. So she did eventually find AJ, obviously. Um... I want to cover the whole series of The Walking Dead uh, from Telltale Games. It is by far their best game that they've ever created. Um, and it's one of my favorite genres as well. Like an interactive, um, story-driven game, pretty much. It's multi-choice more than actually playing. Sometimes you just want to chill, you know? Sit back and enjoy the... the the show as well as uh, as a content creator. Sometimes you just want to have a backseat game as well. And this is like one of the best games to do that with. I also finished all dark picture games except for one. Um, which is Until Dawn. But we finished all their other games as well. Which is also an interactive series. Or an interactive movie if that makes sense. Uh, where your choices is more than actually gameplay. Um you know, different results and outcomes and stuff. Uh, but yeah, there's a lot of games like this, and I would like to cover all of them if I could, honestly. But anyway, guys, that's going to be this video. Uh, we finished The New Frontier. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this. If you did, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and we'll catch you in the next series. Peace.